Good morning, first of all. Good uh, good morning to you. Good afternoon to me. Yes. Um, let's talk about Violent Night. I think one of the funniest movies I think I've seen in a while. And it's uh, it's just edge of your seat. Just nothing but fun in this movie. And uh, what a what a delightful Santa Claus you are. <laughs> <laughs> delightful, violent, yeah, crazy Santa Claus. He's had enough. He's had uh, enough of these bad guys, enough of this naughty list. Yeah. And he's doing something about it. He's uh he's he's giving presents and kicking ass. <laughs> exactly. Was it was was everything on the script when you got the script? No, I mean we definitely had times. It was a very creative movie in the sense of we played around a lot. And um you know, certain sequences would be just, you know, he bandages his wound. And then we turned that into an entire thing with wrapping paper and ribbons. And, you know, there was just fun stuff all throughout that we would elaborate on. But one of the biggest things was I knew that there was a lot of comedy, a lot of action. But me and the director kept coming back to the idea that I want people to leave this movie feeling like the spirit of Christmas. And I wanted them to feel like they watched a Christmas movie. And so me, my relationship with that little girl a lot of that we developed and worked on and tried to get more and more scenes with the two of them so that we could really flesh out that emotional core. Yeah, it's it's really got that great balance of, you know, you, you've got the violence in it, of course, but you, again, it's so touching in places. Yeah, that was really important to us because I wanted you to go on a zigzaggy ride of like, you know, crazy violence and humor, but I wanted at the end of the day for this to be a movie that you can watch at Christmas with your pals and be like, and make you feel that <laughs> Christmas spirit. Uh, how does it feel to be America's number one action star? <laughs> <laughs> if that's true, it feels great. <laughs> as as an actor, though, do you lean more toward comedy than than drama? You know, personally. Um, it's it's funny. I'm I'm in love with both of them, uh, but I guess in general, I you know I think. I'm I steer toward the dramas. Like that seems to be more my wheelhouse. Mm -hmm. But when I get a chance to play comedy, I really, it's really refreshing and it's really enjoyable. I mean, the fun thing about this is you're not really playing jokes. I mean, sort of the more deadpan and dry and serious you are as Santa Claus, the funnier it is, you know. <laughs> you know, and he's he's like a Roger Moore James Bond. He has those great lines, you know. Um you know, after he he wipes somebody out, it's just, you know, it's just the icing on the cake, you know, for, for the role. Yeah, there's a couple one-liners in there that are, you know, it plays on words around Santa, you know, Felice Navi dead, eating through a bunch of guys like a plate full of cookies. There are tons of one-liners in there. You know, yeah, some, you're of them, some of them are just in the trailer too, though. Some of them come out of the film, but yeah. Uh, in our final moments we have, what do you think audiences are going to take away from, from watching uh, Violet Night? I mean, I think you're going to obviously have a lot of fun and you're going to watch a great action comedy. But again, like my hope, and I do feel like it is that you'll, you know, you certainly leave your cares for a couple hours, but that you'll come out feeling, you know, singing Christmas tunes and just feeling that spirit of Christmas, which is like, you know, togetherness and generosity and peace on earth after this wacky action movie. <laughs> and it is wacky. Uh, David Harbour, I always enjoy talking with you. You're a great guy and a, a terrific actor and uh, all the best seasons greetings to you and, and, and uh, hope to see you on the very next one. Thank you very much. Merry Christmas to you too.